Edna, and this week we are doing a chop challenge. So Atlanta has literally challenged us to come up with a recipe with these ingredients. We have spinach, eggs, hot dogs, and popcorn. And we'll see what we come up with, but let's get cooking. So first things first, we got was a pan. We then added some olive oil to it because we needed a way to be able to heat up our ingredients. And the easiest thing to start with were the eggs. We decided to add those in the pan and we knew we needed some seasoning. So we grabbed our trusty Cajun because you can never go wrong with some spice in Houston. And then we got our hot dogs, chopped them up into little pieces and went ahead and added them to the pan. We want to hear from you though. Let us know in the comments below if your parents or guardians ever made you scrambled eggs and hot dogs. We remember that from our childhood, so it was kind of odd and familiar seeing those ingredients for our chop challenge. Um, but then afterwards, let's get back to our recipe. So afterwards, we decided to mix it all together and then we wanted to grab our trusty spinach. We added that spinach to our scrambled egg hot dog mix. And we didn't want our food to burn, so we added some more olive oil and we needed a little extra kick. So we got our Cajun and now we're just going to mix it all together. Make sure that everything gets cooked evenly and the spices get evenly distributed because we need every little bit, every little leaf, every little hot dog to get that seasoning in. And we were thinking, okay, so we still have that popcorn added to our ingredients. What are we going to do with it? We decided we're gonna go ahead and make our popcorn in the microwave and make sure that our pan, everything in our pan is well cooked. So then we plated our egg, scrambled eggs, and decided to use the popcorn as a little decoration for our final recipe. And hopefully our secret taste tester gives us a really good score for this uh, weird, amazing creation. Too bad so far. I'll follow up some popcorn. Uh, I will say it's very unique. One to ten. Okay. How about an eight? So he rated it an eight. I think he was just being nice. But Houston is now gonna challenge Tampa. Check out their video on stuff to do in Tampa to see what ingredients we picked out for them. 